A tragic story from over the weekend raises questions about your responsibilities as a passenger in a rideshare vehicle. On Saturday night, police say a drunk driver going 100 miles an hour hit an Uber head on, killing a passenger who wasn't wearing a seatbelt. The drunk driver and Uber driver were both injured. KGW's Kristen Severance is here to verify whether Uber is responsible for a passenger who's not wearing a seatbelt during a crash. What did you learn? So this is pretty clear. So it is up to the passenger, not the driver of any ride sharing company when it comes to wearing your seatbelt. According to the law and according to these ride sharing companies, you, the passenger, must decide if you're going to wear your seatbelt. It doesn't matter if you're in an Uber, Lyft, or taxi in both Oregon and Washington. If you're at least 16 years old, it's your responsibility to wear your seatbelt. If you're not wearing one as a passenger, you could get a ticket, not the driver. For people under 16, it's the driver's responsibility to make sure they're buckled up. Of course, some Uber drivers say while most riders do wear their seatbelts, some just choose not to. It's your decision. You get your own ticket. Um, I wear my seatbelt. It's kind of up to you. I can't force you to, and I can't cancel rides. You know, I mean, if I cancel too many rides, I have the risk of deactivation. Yeah, so I can also verify, according to Uber, if you don't wear your seatbelt, some drivers will actually give you, the passenger, a lower rating. Interesting. So yeah. buckle up for sure yeah, for course. many reasons. Yes, of course, buckle up for safety and it's on you. You know, it's on you, the passenger. You could get a ticket if you're in the back seat of an Uber and a police officer pulls you over. You get the ticket, not the driver. And then, of course, the interesting tidbit that the drivers could lower your rating. For yeah, I mean, it's, and it's a good reminder, too, because I often, when do I ever find myself sitting in the back seat other mm -hmm. than being in an Uber? And the car usually reminds you in the front seat to put your belt on by beeping at you. So. Exactly. All right, Kristen, thank, thank you, you so much. You bet, you bet. If you have something you'd like us to verify, reach out to us. You can do it by email, verify at kgw.com.